Hallo, hier Dark Server mit dem Let's Play Life is Strange Part 21? Nein, 25. Ich muss mir das mal wieder aufschreiben. Fängt wieder super an mit der ganzen Folge hier. Also Part 25, Episode 4 von Life is Strange. So, ja, würde ich sagen, fangen wir doch direkt an. Was bisher geschah. Previously on Life is Strange. Whoa. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Don't ever touch me again, freak! Let's talk about your superpower. What are you doing here, Max? Stop! Don't come near me! Not now! It won't work! I know this isn't pleasant for any of us. Miss Caulfield, please, tell us everything. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. That's Rachel's bracelet! Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Welcome to my domain. Let's find what we want and beat it. Max, you better come check out these files. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. Listen, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank. Being more than a friend. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? No, you don't. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? Ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. <laughs> Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? This is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Max Caulfield. Hold on. Chloe, you have a visitor. So, sind wir auf den neuesten Stand. Und ja, immer noch hat jede einzelne Handlung Konsequenzen. Weise viele. Jetzt wissen wir es aber. Life is Strange, Episode 4, Dark Room. It's weird hanging out with you again. I know. I'm glad we are, though. It was nice that you sent me actual letters. It's more than any of my other friends have done. And you even wrote on that cool parchment paper. It's so Max. So pretentious. But I love writing on it like 
an English poet. You deserve the best stationery. Probably easier to write than to visit me. I don't mean that in a bitchy way. Not totally. You probably wanted to avoid awkward conversations like this. Uh, pretty much, yeah. Look, the worst thing you can do is treat me like a baby. I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can we stop? This is seriously the best view of the sunset. What do photographers call that? The golden hour. See? Without you here, I'd have no clue. Bet you could take some amazing shots. Those beached whales are so sad. I kind of know how they feel. At least, I'm alive here with you. You're a real survivor, Chloe. I know you have to deal with so much. I don't want anybody else feeling sorry for me. I can do that. Along with my parents. My dad still feels guilty about buying me that car. Ja, genau, das war ja auch der Auslöser, dass sie halt die, die Karre erfahren hat und dann passiert das alles. Äh, Boo, äh, Blaine William, ah, wie er nicht sagen, ich würde sagen, Talk about accident ist äh, hier die richtige Variante. Are you okay to talk about the accident? We never actually have, huh? There's not much to say. Some prick in an SUV cut me off and I flew into a ditch. Do you remember everything? I saw everything in bullet time. I felt my back snap and... And that was the last thing I ever felt in my body. When I woke up in the hospital, I literally couldn't move a muscle. Jesus. I, I, I don't know what to say. Don't say anything. I'm just happy I did get to see you again. I could have ended up vanishing out of the blue like that girl from Blackwell. Ja, äh, man muss jetzt auch bedenken, in dieser anderen Realität oder anderen Zeitlinie ist natürlich alles ein bisschen anders und deswegen würde ich nicht jetzt sagen, you mean Rachel. Ähm, kommt hier mich ein bisschen anders dann raus. Also sie würde jetzt das direkt ansprechen, als wenn es ihre Freunde wäre. Aber das wäre ja unschlau, weil wir ja nicht wirklich wissen, ob sie mit ihr wirklich was zu tun hat. Also what missing girl? What, what missing girl? I don't know her name. I just read about it in the news. I feel bad for her family. This is such a different world than when we were kids, isn't it? After that snow and eclipse, it's more like the end of the world. Hey, it's hat sich irgendwie alles wieder nicht so. You think? Don't say that. It might be. Ich tendiere ja zu Y. It might be, but I'd like to think we can still change things for the better. I'd like to think that too, but I don't have much hope these days. I know things seem out of control, but. As long as we're together, I don't feel afraid. Hanging out with you makes me feel like a total kid again. You don't even know. Listen, Chloe, I'm sorry I haven't been out to see you more. That was wrong. You're my best friend. Max, thanks for coming out to see me. You're, you're doing awesome. I don't think so. Um, my, my nose is getting cold. Maybe we should get back to my place? It is hella cold out here. Hella? I hate that word, no offense. None taken. Ja, daran merkt man, dass die Persönlichkeiten von den beiden Realitäten ziemlich stark sich unterscheiden. Again, the lighthouse. Um, naja, nicht in der Reihenfolge. Oh, 
It's a pretty high-tech lair. Feels like a high-tech cell. But I am lucky my parents bust their ass to take care of me. I know it's hard for them. They're grateful you're here with them. Right. Especially when they can't even take a walk alone. Mm. Sometimes I act like a total teenage brat just to give them an excuse to yell at me. Pathetic, I know. Chloe, you're a great daughter. You're kind and sensitive when you don't even have to be. Trust me, I still get my rage on. Especially when a nurse has to watch while I take a dump so she can wipe my bum. Or when doctors flip me around like I was a science doll. I can't even imagine. But you're still amazing. You always have been since we were kids. Thanks again for coming, Max. I, uh, <clears throat> need to get my drink on. Uh, can you, can you bring me some water? Sure. So, äh, uh, ich bin jetzt vorhin schon aufgefallen, ich hätte ja von Anfang an schon mal was sagen sollen. Ähm, um, diese vierte Episode wird, ähm, um, hm, wie soll ich das am besten ausdrücken, emotional gesehen grausam. Das ist das Beste, was mir jetzt dazu einfällt. Uh, deswegen uh, macht euch auf einiges gefasst. Das wird keine einfache Folge. Also, gesamte äh, vierte Episode, meine ich. Oh, man. She has to use that ventilator just to breathe. Genau, denn ihre Lungen sind angeschlagen durch diesen Unfall. At least Chloe doesn't weigh that much. Und ja, wir geben ihr dann natürlich das Trinken, aber ähm, ich will mich erst mal umschauen. Denn, ähm, <lacht> erstens kommen dann noch zwischendurch immer Dialoge. Und zweitens würde dadurch wieder ein weiterer Dialog hinzugefügt werden. Gleich könnte er das alles auch zum Schluss machen. Aber ich will so alles nach und nach machen. I'm glad I took this photo. Chloe has a new memory of William and her together. Ja, aber ob es das im Ende wert war für uns, meine ich jetzt, oder im Insgesamt überhaupt wert war, ähm, das er dahin erstellt. Does Chloe look at the garden and think about her childhood? She can't even feel the grass now. Ja, wenn ich das noch richtig im Kopf habe, ist er ja ab dem Genick äh, abwärts gelingt. That's a serious heat lamp. Hello, Chloe. She likes fluffy animals now. Ja, Rebellion war ja nicht notwendig, ne? Oh, the snow dough. I guess not everything changed. Ähm, dieser Dastri hat eine tiefere Bedeutung. Ähm, dazu sag ich aber jetzt lieber noch nichts. Also erst wenn es soweit ist. Snow globes are taking over. I still can't believe I put Chloe in that chair. The board. Chloe's message board since the accident sure looks lonely. I didn't. I'm glad you think so. Ja, das ist so ziemlich so ab und zu mal so der Nachteil, wenn man schon hier irgendwie was durchsucht, dann kann es sein, dass dann noch hier die Konversation dazwischen funkt. Klar, irgendwo will man das mitnehmen, aber irgendwo ist es auch ein bisschen blöd, weil, weil man will ja eigentlich alles mitbekommen. Also sowohl als auch, also sowohl hier die Gespräche, die zwischendurch reinkommen, als auch das, was hier dazu halt sagt. It's nice my parents sent a card at least. Ich denke, das kann man auch so lesen. I wonder who this is. Kind of a generic card. Megan. Über die werden wir, ja, nicht sehr viel erfahren, aber genug. I wasn't very available to Chloe. Real nice. Äh, ja, kann man lesen. Hoffe ich mal. At least I sent road trip selfies to Chloe. I'm sure that made her feel great. Hier bin ich mir nie sicher, ob sie das wirklich so meint oder eher sarkastisch zu sich selbst. Man. 
Joyce and William built a whole new bathroom for Chloe. They're so great. Das ist wohl wahr. Make up. I should offer to put makeup on for Chloe. Not that I can, but it would be fun. Notwendigkeit. <lacht> ah, hier. There's the old Chloe. An die wir uns alle erinnern. So, was haben wir hier? Whoa, Chloe can totally control her computer. It's so great people get this high-tech help. Er weiß mich allerdings, wozu dann noch die Tastatur kann ja ihre Arme eigentlich nicht nutzen. Gescheit in ihre Hände. That is so incredible. And she can browse cat videos on the web. Chloe is still a punk at heart. But she can't stage dive anymore. Ja, das ist das Negative an der ganzen Sache. Weil ich das halt selbst nicht mehr so richtig in Aktion gehen kann. Also ob sich nicht richtig bewegen kann, hat es auch keinen großen Sinn, sich halt dementsprechend zu kleiden bzw. Tattoos zu geben etc. That's so cool that Chloe has made friends online. Ja, ihr könnt selbst lesen. So und äh, nur noch das hier. That must be her mighty morphine machine. No more bongs for her. Ja, die sind wirklich nicht mehr notwendig. Um. Instead of handing Chloe a bong, I'm feeding her water. Did I give her a choice? So, äh, das hatten wir die ganze Zeit jetzt schon vorher gehabt, also... Drink up, Buttercup. Oh man, no wonder my throat is dry. I don't think I've talked this much the whole year. Have you ever thought about doing a podcast or something? I wish I could punch your face right now. <laughs> a podcast? Dude, I am a pod in a cast. Boring. Ouch. It was just a thought. I know you're just trying to help. <sighs> yeah, that's become a bad habit of mine. You sound like an adult now. It seems like we were kids in another life. Uh, you're right. You're right. I wish I could take us all the way back there again. Wish I could build us a DeLorean. Oh, well, um, y y with your scientific mind, you might do that. But time travel can screw things up, too. Plus, he'd have to be my live-in assistant to help me build a machine. As you can see, I can't keep all my other friends away. Ja, jetzt könnten wir bestimmt sein und you have me sagen, aber... Da muss man jetzt wieder bedenken, wir waren jetzt wie viele Jahre nicht hier. Da haben vielleicht ab und zu eine geschrieben, aber nee. Ob das hier vielleicht war, ist eine andere Sache. Und Witch Friends ist als hält sich jetzt erstmal so negativ an. Aber tatsächlich ist es positiver, als es hier den Anschein hat. Which friends did you hang out with the most? Megan Weaver, but you don't know her. She was cool. But after my accident, she was too cool for school. I know I wasn't around much. No excuses, I'm a loser. But I am trying to make things right. How? Dude, you're not super max. And I'm not trying to guilt trip you. That's what my parents are for. Yeah, uh... By team... Habe ich, ich muss sagen, hier habe ich die Gespräche nie äh, großartig ausprobiert. Ich habe es immer wieder, ähm, ja, ich habe immer wieder die gleiche Sache genommen. Um, obwohl, äh, äh, ich meine, Are You Lonely ist, ist nicht falsch. I love you, ja, es ist, ist halt so eine Standardaussage und Are They Okay? bezieht sich halt quasi nur auf die Eltern selbst. Um, I don't know. Ich, ich würde das am liebsten hier blind drücken, was aber für mich unmöglich ist. Also ich einfach Are you lonely? I know this is a dumb question, but are you lonely here? Yes, dumb question. I don't mind being alone. I can't exactly go party like a rockstar though, or get in 18 trouble with the folks. 
I think Joyce and William are incredible. Max, the accident has been so hard on them. Our insurance sucks, and the medical bills are fucking insane. <laughs> I bet. This tech must be crazy expensive. Along with the drugs, the nurses, the supplies. Mom and Dad are always broke, and they get so frustrated. Is it worth it? Chloe, you're priceless. Uh, <laughs> no pun intended. <laughs> you are such a geek. That's why I love you. Of course, I know a geek when I be one. See, I'm practically a human entertainment system. It would be sweet to chill out together and watch a movie like when you'd spend the night at my house. <laughs> what do you want to watch? Uh, I think I'm in like a, a mellow Blade Runner mood. I always cry at the end. Plus, you know, I always wanted to have cool colored bangs like Pris. I know. You would look incredible with blue hair. Now let's get this show on the road. And you better not fall asleep on me like you always do when we watch movies. I remember, Max. Swear I won't fall asleep. Not when you're here. Not yet. <lacht> okay. Ähm, ich beende jetzt mal lieber diese Folge, sonst wird sich das, das wirklich lang hinziehen. Ähm, ja. Erst einmal willkommen zu dieser Folge und ich hoffe, ich hatte es. Really ich ich glaube, ich sollte mal lieber hier drauf drücken. Äh, ja, ich hoffe, es hat euch bis hierhin erstmal gefallen. Auch wenn es gerade mal einfach in der ersten Episode ist. Äh, der fünften Episode. Oh Gott. Ich bin sowas von durch. Ähm, ja. Bis zur nächsten Folge. Euer Dark Saber.